there and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another moving vlog. We are really getting things together in this place and I'd love to show you all of the progress that we have made. If you want to see more videos like this, then please like and subscribe and keep on watching. I ended up not being able to sleep last night, so I did some painting. So you might remember that this wall here was green. I will insert a clip of what it used to look like, but I have painted it this white color. Like you can maybe see that it's different. This is, um, the color is called platinum, and then this wall is white. Here, the lighting's bad right now, but that is platinum, and this is the white. And I have some plans. I'm going to make this into a feature wall. And I have a really cool idea. It's going to be like very subtle fish or dragon scales. So hopefully it'll work out and I'll be able to show you. And if it doesn't work out, then I'm probably just going to paint it over with the same platinum. And then also last night, I did the first coat of the dark blue master bedroom. And I'm really not sure how to feel about it yet. I know it's just because it's the first coat. So it is going to look different than this. Um, it's going to be kind of darker and more blue-gray, but it does make the room look a lot smaller, so I'm kind of uneasy at this point on how it's turning out. Also, I couldn't reach the ceilings, so my husband will have to do the trim um, before I put on the second coat. But yeah, what do you think? Do you like dark bedrooms or do you like light bedrooms to keep the room looking big? And we moved our master stuff um, from this room into this room while I finished painting the master. And this room is so cozy. I love how it turned out. I actually love this dark gray. I think it's so cool. And when you're in here at night, it just feels like, yeah, just so cozy and nice. I love it. I was joking the other day to my husband. We put some of his construction stuff in here and he chose this uh, wall color. And I was joking to him that it goes so well with his construction clothes. Look, it's like the perfect asphalt gray. <laughs> From the hallway, this is what you see so far. So this room is going to be gray and this is going to be dark blue. And we just decided we hated that blue color that was there before. Um, let me insert a clip of what this used to look like. And that was just such an ugly, like, childish bubblegum blue that just really didn't suit us but these darker colors I think are totally our personality. We got a package from Simons. We got this plaid doormat but I think I'm gonna save it and put it out after winter because we have this really ugly one that the last people left and it's winter in Canada so if we put it there now, it will get destroyed right away. But isn't it cute? And then these are our new curtains. These curtains were $40 at Simon's, so $20 per panel. And we are a little bit disappointed in how sheer they are. We thought that they would be more like white, like we have curtains in the dining room that are a little bit more light blocking than this. Um, we didn't want them to be completely room darkening, but we didn't think that they would be as sheer as this. The yellow and gray diamonds on the curtains though are really pretty, so we are going to keep them for now. I have finished painting this blue room. I really love how it came out. It's really dark, but it's still like kind of a mature blue, and I just think it's going to be so nice to sleep in here at night. So we have been living in this place for about two weeks now and we're definitely starting to feel a little bit drained that the place is not done yet. We still have furniture to pick up. We have furniture to refurbish. We still have to do that one accent wall and everything's still just not settled. And I think it's starting to kind of affect the two of us um, and that we just want our home to kind of be done so that this can be a place where we relax. So that's something that I've noticed in other people's vlogs as well when they're moving and they're painting and all of that, that they just want it to be done 
and there's a part of me that wants to just buy everything we need to buy and just like buy our bed frames and buy everything that we need to buy but I'm trying to be reasonable and space out our purchases because some of this stuff is not absolutely necessary to have right now but we're just feeling drained and we want everything to be done <laughs> so and this is this is a struggle that everyone I think goes through when they move we are just making sacrifices today because we know that in the future we're gonna have a much nicer place if we can just make the sacrifice to space out things and just be okay with the fact that everything is not complete and everything is not perfect and that's true of everything in life like sometimes you just have to be okay with good enough um, until you can improve things so how I hope all of you are doing really well. I'm gonna end today's vlog here and hopefully my future wall will be done and I'll have some furniture for the next vlog. And I appreciate so much that you guys have been watching. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time.